Ito na ito. Ah. Hello viewers, this is Posh family and um, I have met a friend who is going to explain to you about different animals. This friend of mine has been in Africa many times. He has been hunting uh, and going to Africa with a hunting group. So let us go in and see what he does. I just want him to explain to you, he has so many pictures for animals he has taken them and he has built them and put them on his wall so let us see what he has in the store for us okay so let's go on and see so as we see here Uh, he has different animals like that one. What is the name of that animal? This is a young fishing eagle. Uh huh. Then uh, you can explain to us this type and of animal. And then the next is is a horn from three three uh, different water water from uh, Africa. Uh huh. And mm. the next one is an one? this one. This one is an impala uh -huh. from Africa and. This is uh, from Springbok. Which one? Also from the yeah, Springbok. That's a national animal in uh, South Africa. Uh -huh. So the next one is an Urix, or the Gemsbok, so they also call him. And the next one you have there is a red harvest. This? Red harvest. Uh -huh. And then you come to uh, and a small one beside is, uh, is an, uh, a diker. And uh, under you have to told the teeth from uh, three big animals, all medals. Okay. Now the the uh, the biggest one is a farm record on uh, White Land Farm in Namibia. Uh -huh. And so next we get another springbok, and then under spring horn of springboks, and other horn of urix and teeth of of uh, war dog, and then a small one. In the corner, that is Steinbock. Uh -huh. And uh, this is a horn from Blesbock. Okay. Add from a blue wildebeest. And a red harvest again. And a new Impala. And a red harvest again. Uh -huh. And a new Blesbock. Okay, and, and an old Impala. Uh -huh. And then you get, uh, you see, many small horns from Rodeer. Okay, show us. Yes, you see, uh, so they so are all shot in Poland. Uh -huh. Okay, in Poland. Yes. So what, I, about, I, I, you have what about this? A moment. Uh, you can, then we come to a uh, horn from moose shot on Finskogen in Norway. Ah. Uh -huh. And the other second one you see here is a silver medal horn. And, and the next one is the nicest antelope in Africa. It's a kudu. The next biggest you have one who's, who's uh, high. Uh, so it's bigger, but the, the, this can be up to 290 kilo. So it's the next biggest. Okay, so I just want to ask you, how long have you gone to Africa? I have been there 11 times. 11 times? Yes. So what was the main purpose for you going to Africa? And that was hunting, of course. So oh, you were hunt. hunting animals? Hunting animals, and when we was in uh, Swakopmund in uh, Namibia, we were also saw fishing. Oh, you also fish. And when you hunt animals, for example, you kill them, you shoot them. So what do you do with this uh, animal? No, we had people that uh, they, they had uh, cars, but they had winches, so they take them up if they are uh, heavy. And they had uh, have uh, people on the farm that take care of the meat and prepare the trophies. Oh, so, so you... We, we, have, we, have, uh, we don't have to do anything, we, have, we only shoot them. Oh, you only shoot animals, and then the people, the game reserve people, they take the animals. Yeah, they take care, uh, of the, take care of the meat they, they and prepare, the, meat. prepare uh, the trophies. Okay, so which means, but do, do you, have you happened to eat some of this meat? 
Yes, yes, of course, they have very nice meat on, on the, almost every, uh, all of them, raw dog, blue wild best is, is the first meal I had in South Africa was indre filet of uh, blue wild best, it's very, very nice. Okay. It's splendid. Mm -hmm. Because I see the animals are very, very nice. Uh, when I look at them. And this you can mm -hmm. see here, I have a specialist today. If you see the two yeah. brother horns here. These two was fighting in, in the autumn, last autumn, with each other. And the big one on left, he, had, he has this got one. his horn in the stomach of the, of the, of the, of the smaller one. Uh, and they, they, they went from the Viltenda had to come to kill them. Ah, well, that's okay. why I have to take care of them. So I have not shot them, but they had the big, the big one with a very long spitz horn. He had got it long in the, you see the second horn on the, and the, 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 the take that, there. The, uh, this, the, 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 no, 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 there, there. Uh -huh. the, uh, no, this, you say. This one. No, no, the, yeah, the, just explain, just explain. I think that this had, he said got all in be, behind, also he stood in the stomach of the other one, so they could not come free. Okay, so I'm seeing that you you really have a heart for animals. So there are many here that uh, you have. This is really interesting because I've been here in Norway and I've not seen this. Somebody just going to Africa and uh, coming up with all these but I'm also wondering, how do you build up an animal like this? What happens? Who does this for you? Well, because this is not really Yeah, no, 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 there is this special preference. In, uh, in Namibia, they only have two, I think. They so are very somebody who does this, building this? Yeah, they, 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 they are the preparation. It's a form of preparation. And in that the biggest in Namibia, there's 60 persons working all of the year to making making these trophies. Okay, so ah, okay, so these are trophies. Yeah. Okay, so thank you very much at least for listening to your story. Going to Africa for hunting, that's really something that uh, I have not heard of, but I'm just hearing for the first time from you that uh, people travel from Europe going to Africa for hunting. So thank you very much. So next time you carry along with an animal, live animal to Norway, so that you can see it live. So. <laughs> Yes. This is really nice. Yeah. How the, the, um, bye bye, my people, for listening to this gentleman about animals in Africa. Thank you. See you next time. Stop.